Okay, this is a trailer for Death on the Nile. The trailer just dropped today as of the recording of this, which is, um, well, now it's the next day, but uh, August 19th, Wednesday. I don't remember if I was aware that this was being remade, but if I was, I forgot. I noticed it because it had a thumbnail of Gal Gadot, and I was... And then I saw the title. I'm like, oh, okay. So what I don't know is, so they had they had redone Murder on the Orient Express a few years ago. Kenneth Branagh. Oh, I think think he's back. I was at first thinking is Johnny Depp back, but I forgot he played the other character. He played the one that's not coming back. Um, so it sounds to me, based on the comments that I skimmed through, because I was curious to find out, was Johnny Depp coming back? It was a major brain fart I had there. And someone mentioned Kenneth Branagh. So I, I guess he's back. This is another one of his. I wasn't sure if they were going to continue on with these stories because it seemed like Murder on the Orient Express wasn't hugely well-received. I didn't mind it. Um, I watched it didn't pay a hundred percent attention to it, but I didn't, it seemed okay to me. Um, anyway, recently death on the Nile and murder on the Orient Express, the original, well, the older version, I don't know how many versions of this they've made, but the, the one from back in the seventies, I, I think it was the seventies. Um, they had been playing a few months ago on Pluto TV, one of the channels on there. And so I had watched them, you know, cause they, they were streaming them constantly. So I know the, how this story goes. I've never read Agatha Christie books, but I know how this goes and I'll still watch it. Even though I know how it goes, I, I, I don't know if they're going to change anything up majorly. I mean, I don't think they will. They didn't with the Johnny Depp one. So anyway, that's a long rambly way of introducing this trailer. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and press play. The romance of the desert has the power to seduce. I ask you. Have you ever loved so much? So possessed by jealousy. That you might kill. You had something to hide. The crime is murder. Should have hidden it, shouldn't you? The murderer is one of you. I don't feel safe here. I don't feel safe with any of them. It's too late to change events. It's time accident. to face the consequences. I have investigated many crimes, but this has altered the shape of my soul. I am Detective Hercule Poirot, and I will deliver your killer. How many great stories are tragedies? Okay, that song. What song was that? Because it sounds like a remake of a song I, I already know, and I, I don't know if that's the same people that, that sang this particular remake version. Oh, that's going to bug me now. Sounds like it was a song from the 80s that I'm familiar with, but I, I'm not, I can't place it. Oh, that's going to bug me. If anybody here recognizes it, let me know. Um, anyway, okay, I mean, it, it looks... It looks like it's going to be a pretty faithful retelling of the, uh, you know, the, the original source material. And uh, it says the release date, but I don't know if that's it's going to be coming to theaters. I, I probably would not go see it, even if 
theaters were open and it was coming to theaters, I probably would not go see that. Like I've mentioned before, I'm, you know, I'm fairly selective about what I go see. Gosh, the last movie I saw on the big screen this year was Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> I missed the big screen. <laughs> um, anyway, but yeah, this is something I'll watch. The trailer was, was decently done. It was less than two minutes and a minute and 50 to get to this, you know, black screen right here. So it, it flowed well. And, um, you get a sense for what's going to, you know, you get a sense for the overall theme, sort of, kind of. But since I already am familiar with it, I know, I mean, I, I know what's going to happen to some of these characters that I recognized as far as who they were supposed to be. But, uh, I, I mean, I'd be surprised if it's changed up, really, from from the original. Um, so I don't, I don't even know why I would be interested to watch it, because I know what's going to happen. But, it's a it's a brand new cast. Um, you know, I'm just wondering maybe the quality of the filming will be a little better than what we got, you know, with the version from like the 70s, which I believe it was the 70s, not early 80s. I, what, what, it's whatever, decades old. Um, and I, I don't know if Kenneth Branagh directed this one. I thought he directed the other one. Unless I'm mistaken. Um, so I I wonder if he directed directed this. I thought maybe someone in the comments mentioned that about, about Brana. Um, anyway, well, that's not really super relevant for purposes of this video, just kind of talking off the top of my head. So anyway, well, this was fun. Um, I haven't seen a movie trailer in a few days uh, because I've just been too busy to record a whole lot. I've been typically only able to do like one a day, only being able to post about one a day. So, um, and, and while I'm in the work crunch, it, it may just, it may end up being that that's how I have to do it for a little while. We'll see. But, um, okay. I think there was another trailer I was going to check out before I call it quits for the evening or early morning. <laughs> okay, y'all. Bye. Bye.